Okay, welcome back everyone to some more Harvest Stella. Right, carrying on exactly where we left off. Let's shoot some robots. And uh, yeah, I'm so glad we made it through that last room. That room was a bloody nightmare. I was really dreading that it would take me several attempts to get through it. <laughs> um, but yes, no, we, we made it and gonna get through hopefully the rest of this dungeon today. That's the plan anyway. Don't know if uh, if the game will allow this to happen. Uh, we've got a switch here and teleporter C next to us. Door barrier deployed. Deactivating alarm laser. Well, that's good. So I can't go through that door anymore. Uh, question is, is that going to affect any of the other doors that I maybe need to go through? Well, we can open this switch anyway. Uh, so that's nice. And now I think we must have to go to yeah, I'm guessing if we went through D before pressing that switch, it wouldn't have worked. I we so, retreat. turning off the lasers is also a big, big bonus. Okay. Where's D going to take us? Uh, to E, of course, but um, looks like we can also create a little shortcut back to the monolite. Fantastic. Jolly good. Because it is, yeah, it's quite late in the day. So... Uh, oh, we got a search spot here. There's a switch and a shutter on the wall. The words Lost Gaia Sample are written near the shutter. Pressing the switch might open the shutter. Uh, ha ha ha. Right, well, the last one we did of these uh, turned out bad, so I'm gonna say yes. You press it and the shutter opens. A cold mist along with a plethora of ingredients tumble out. It seems to be a harvest from Lost Gaia. Oh, goodies! Hey, powder leaf, ginger wasabi, and lost rice. I would have liked some carrots, actually, but... Something else rolls out, along with the ingredients. Oh, boy. It's some well-preserved lost Gaia monsters. The monsters take a moment, then leap out and attack you. Okay, so this was... Oh, gosh. Look at those things. Yeah. Um, this was kind of a pros and cons turn out. That's fine. So, are we going to have to fight Arya today, chaps? I, I really do feel like it's building up to that. It's got to be. It's got to be. Oh, that finisher. Ooh, soft cotton. Right. Oh, my backpack's full. I guess we can't take the limestone. What a shame. Uh, yeah, it's it's near the end of the day anyway, and I don't foresee that we'll be able to make any much more progress here. So, we'll just head back. Head back home. And continue this tomorrow. And yeah, I did have my orange juice, by the way. I had my orange juice and it was mm, so good. So, so good. Right, let's throw all this random crap in the box. Yeah, that's why my bloody backpack's full, because I've just got all those goddamn ingredients. Uh, yeah, I feel like we might even need more food than this, you know. We did get a lot of corn soup, though. And we've got plenty of juice. Nah, we should be fine, right? We should be okay. Yeah, we're okay. Right, uh, I mean, maybe there's a few more things I could do today. Maybe I should do a bit more cooking. Uh, harvest chili plants, times 50. Three more to go. Although, again, I do feel like we, we're getting towards the end of the game, so I don't know how much more of the farm stuff is really going to be relevant to me. Um, If I ever do play through this game again, though, I'll obviously know much more about it, and we'll probably be able to advance my farm a lot quicker. But, uh, yeah, this is, this is my first, first one. You know what, I'm gonna make another, another few corn soups. Corn soup? What's the mul multiple of soups? The soup. Is it soups? It's not soups, is it? <laughs> it's just soup. There's lots of soup, and then there's little amounts of soup. Okay, that should probably do us, I'd say. Yeah. Let's get to bed. Did we kill enough things to get a level, do you reckon? Ooh, not quite. Not quite. Nearly level 60, though. And, uh... Holy shit. Well, that's a good... Yeah, you know what? Those chili plants? Pretty good investment, aren't they? Holy crap. Over 50k. 
That's mental. Well, I'm thinking now, maybe... Maybe I do go and get the backpack upgrade. I might actually do that, you know. Oh, it must be raining outside. There you go. I feel so bad I don't pet you often enough, do I? Right, yeah, I think we might go buy the backpack upgrade then. Are any more chili plants ready? D D. Uh, oh, we got a letter though. Ah, from Shrieker. The silver blossom. As gratitude for all your help, I wish to share the words. Grow a silver blossom. It is a favorite verse of mine, because if you do not take care of this blossom, the silver glow will fade. It is as fragile as it is beautiful. The silver blossom grows in the hearts of people and will bloom no matter how cold or harsh the environment. Then and now, these words are the light that shines upon me. Well, that that's great, Shrieker. That's great. I, I, I don't know what that means, but that's great. Uh, sadly, no letters from Danthus or Unicorn. Right. Grab the Meekans. Uh, looks like we got more promised fruit at the back as well. Yeah, no, no chili plants ready yet. That's fine. I don't think I'm going to bother buying any more of them either, to be honest. We, we've made our money. I'm going to get the backpack upgrade and probably it's be satisfied with that. Good morning! Yeah, not raining, but snowy. But, uh, yeah. No livestock then. That's alright. So I'm going to grab the eggs, though. And the milk. Speaking of milk, let's chug some. Although I really, I really should be eating the mushrooms because they're less HP and still hunger. So yeah, we'll do those. Right, let's go to the village. Oh, actually, don't want to pop anything away. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. D D D D. Yeah, we got we got plenty of food. We got plenty of food. I really should probably just put the bloody bombs away. <laughs> bombs away. Because I'm not going to end up using the level 1 bombs anytime soon, am I? It's probably just a waste of an inventory slot. Right, back to the village. Dee dee dee. Dee dee dee. And let me buy myself a backpack upgrade. Oh wait, it's not going to be open yet, is it? What time is it open? Oh, it's nearly time anyway. That's fine. We'll just take in the scenery. God, I love this game so much. It's just... It's honestly been such a pleasant surprise. I really hope this gets a sequel. I really do. Right, in we go. I bet she's like, wow, I just bloody opened up. Backpack level four, baby. Bosh. And that's it. That's all the backpack upgrades acquired. The looks of things. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Got plenty of sp so much space for activity. Right. Let's just quickly check then. Oh, look at that. Look at that. I should have done this ages ago, probably. But you know what? It's fine. It's fine. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Right, back to the cradle. Ba -na -na -ba -na -na -na. I still, I still hum that to myself like all the time, all the time. Orbital Gradle. Okay, we got Imperio. Through the door to the right, and into E we go. Yeah, so that, that switch we pressed definitely locks those doors again. Uh, and it looks like we might have to find another switch somewhere. Hello, guys. There we go. Yeah, I'm also thinking I might, uh, I might swap Hine back out. I mean, he is, he's doing a job, and we have just upgraded his weapon. But, um, 
I don't know. I think I think I might put Bracker back in. Or maybe Emo. I do miss Emo, you know. You know what? Yeah, I'm going to quickly go back to the Monolite and swap uh, Emo back in. I like Hein, don't get me wrong. But... Yeah. Okay, didn't mean to do... <laughs> <laughs> Didn't mean to do that, but at least it was just a mushroom. Party. Hein. I think... Yeah, emo. That's better. Right. Where were we? In fact, let's pop the last mushroom just to get a good chunk of hunger. Okie dokie. So that door's locked. That door is currently inaccessible. And I think the switch is probably in this next room, along with another bloody fear monster. Uh, I mean, these guys shouldn't be too much of an issue. Oh my Christ. You can get bloody- you can get stun locked in this game really, really easily. <laughs> Like, really Fire. easily. Ha. Oh, crud. Fire. Ha. Definitely don't want to get caught in that, especially when this thing's already buffed. Ha. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. I think Dianthus just got caught by that, but didn't really do too much. I would use Lethal Trigger, but I feel like it's a bit of a waste now. Oh, Danthus. Oh, luckily, yeah, he didn't take too much damage, though. That's fine. Hi, Emo. It's been a while. Nice to have you back in the po Welcome to the party, pal. Door barrier unlocked. Okay. Oh, shit. The lasers are back. Oh, shit. Um. Let's see, what's through that door? I, I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth it. We're not going to kill the fear monster. We just lure it away. Um. So, let's go back this way. Hopefully there's no lasers in here as well. Yes, there are. Of course there are. But they don't seem to be moving, so that's fine. Yeah, I like that they've actually implemented this door switch mechanic, because making it also turn off the lasers, it's always like, well, yes, I've found the switch, so now I can make progress. Yay, but also, oh no, it's turned the lasers back on. It's very conflicting feelings. Oh, one shot, bitch. That was insane. That was insane damage. Right, let's keep an eye on everyone's HP. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe crack an egg or two. Right. So we've got G up there, but we also do have another switch here. Where's this gonna go? Oh! Oh crap, there's a password? Oh, I don't know. No, that's not right, is it? Password incorrect. Shit, how are we gonna- f Okay, there must be a password ahead somewhere. Right. Uh... Let the battle commence. Yeah, let's just take care of these guys first. Oh, shibbity dibbity. Right, you're gone. Let's take out the other one. Oh, you resist. Okay, that's fine. Right, now onto this one. Ooh, Danthus taking a bit of a batter in there. Lethal trigger! Making it hail. Maybe I should use the fire one for this one, actually. I don't know. Danthus, good lord, you need some health. Uh, oh god. Juice, juice, juice. Let the battle commence. Just not paying attention to Danth Danthus's health! Oh god! Oh, oh. Danthus, look after yourself a bit more. I've only got so much juice, and I want to save that for the boss fights. You have my gratitude. 
Yeah. Jeez. <laughs> right, so let's, yeah. Try and find a password then. Where the heck could it be? Or maybe it's not necessary. Maybe it's just for like a really good item or something. Right, go through. Oh, come on. Bastards. Bastards. Right, Pilgrim. Pilgrim. AoE of Doom. Oh, don't, don't you just love a nice alarm noise? Isn't it just the, the most soothing sound in the world? Don't you just love it when games do that? Alright. You can, you can turn off now. Really high ceilings. Oh boy. Alright, near another bloody switch. Hey, we have. Oh, my AoE of Doom isn't ready! Now it is. Get wrecked, son! That really is probably my favorite <laughs> favorite skill in the whole game. Right, Danthus again. You, you, you're getting a little bit damaged. Can you do a little bit better at dodging things? That would be great. Let's have some cabbage stew. There we go. Right, so I guess uh deactivate the alarm laser. So we just we just came from from H, didn't we? A pyro liquid, okay, open this up. Right, so now now we're back near the beginning. Uh so this makes me think. Well, actually. Maybe we don't want to do this switch yet, because now we can get into I. I'm not sure why we'd want to deactivate that, then. Just keep an eye out for a password, chaps. There's something glistening by the side of the road. I don't know if I'd call this a road. On closer inspection, it seems to be an accessory. Yeah, I'll take it. You received an accessory. There's a locket attached to it. Opening it, you find a picture inside, but the colour's so washed out you can't tell what it's meant to be of. This must belong to somebody who was buried nearby. That feels like that shouldn't be- that should be out in the wild somewhere, not in some weird futuristic sci-fi dungeon. That's very strange. Maybe- I mean, maybe it's something to do with a password, I don't know. Right, uh... Let's really try our very best not to trigger this laser. I think this battle is best avoided. Let's just wait here. We should be good. Okay. Right, I'm not even going to fight you guys. Oh no! No, please! No, no, no! I hate that. I hate that it just freezes you in place. Ooh, more Auric Alchem. Right. Screw you guys. I'm going into J. I think... We must be on the right track, yeah. We're really near a story thing. Hey, we have doom! Stop shooting me, you pricks! Oh yeah, no, 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 no. Leave me alone. Oh god. Uh, let's go back to Avenger. Oh criminy! All right, let's hop over to fire. All right, you stay there. You stay there and take all of that damage over time. Oh, bollocks. Ooh. We're okay. We're all right. We'll just get rid of one of them. It's going to make it a lot easier. Sweet baby Jesus. And all of his disciples. Yeah, jumping out of the AoE in style. Emo, please, please, please try and dodge the AoEs. Again, I probably should be swapping over to 
something else to use its skills. And that'll get you. There we go. Nice. Oh my gosh. Right. So another repair thing level 2 that we can't use. Another door with a switch on the other side. But maybe that's just all optional stuff. Yeah. Sadly can't do that. I mean, at least we've made it to a monolite. That's progress. Oh, Seat of the Harbinger. Oh, we, yeah, we're right outside boss room. So that password door must be something just optional. Okay, um, so I'm not going to worry about it. What I am going to worry about is this bloody boss. You have my gratitude. Okay, okay. It's just one more milk. That's all of our milk gone. So we got to, we should, we're, we're fine on energy now. Um, it's just food. Got plenty of soup. Got plenty of juice. Let's freaking do it. In fact, save. Save before. <laughs> save beforehand. Maybe wise. Might be wise. Let's uh, overwrite file number five. Bam, bam, up, bam. Okay. Oh, Arya. Don't make us do this. I feel something unusual up ahead. Do you still want to continue? I do. You don't change, mage. Well, you do. That's quite the uh, attire you've uh, acquired. You always forge ahead no matter what comes in your way. You're not a quitter. There have been many times when I've found you dependable because of that. But not this time. Okay, she does look really badass, though. I'm your enemy, Abels. I am the Harbinger. You're not a Harbinger, Arya. You're our friend. I somehow don't think that's going to work. You heard Geist, didn't you? You and I are a different species. I am bringing destruction to your world. If that's not a harbinger, then what is? I know why you're here, mage. You want to stop me from dropping the proto, don't you? We've... Yeah, I mean, we kind of have. But at the same time, I mean, can I really blame her? I don't know if I can blame her. You know what I mean? It's such a difficult decision to be in. Ah, If you drop it, the world will... Yes, I know. Which means killing me is the only way for you to survive. But that's stating the obvious, isn't it? No, Arya. We don't want to fight you. Please stop. I miss the old Arya. Yeah, I mean, me too. Don't spout nonsense. Arya? The Paradise Project was humanity's dearest wish. Do you know just how many sacrifices were made for it? My own parents died in its critical experiment. I'm sorry, Arya. I saw the proof of my own eyes. The names were on the register of people who died in service. Oh, crap. I thought her parents were in stasis. Oh, shit. Everyone wanted to secure a future for humanity so much that they were willing to die for it. Now, do you really think I could betray them because of the, the new bonds I've gone and made with you? I mean, again, it's such a... It's an impossible situation. If I abandon their plan now, all of their efforts will have been for nothing. That's why I'm the Harbinger now. Is there really no other way? Is there really no other way of doing... Uh, uh, to destroy one world for another... For the other. I will drop the proto seas light onto the planet and make Heaven's Shell a reality. Those are the lengths I'm prepared to go to. So this is where we part ways. Get your weapons. The version of humanity that commands this battle lives on to the next era. Oh boy, this is what the world has come to. She looks so upset in her portrait. Is this what you really want? What I want is irrelevant. Oh. Guys, start the countdown for the proto descent. Are you sure? It still needs some final adjustments. It's fine, just do it. 
Understood. Oh, this is very sad. Activating Proto Seas Light Descent Sequence. Starting countdown. There's always a countdown, isn't there? They can never just do it instantly, because then it wouldn't be fair, would it? <laughs> Are you trying to intimidate us with that? No, she means it. Now is our only chance to stop the descent. Do we have no choice? Arya. I don't want to fight you. Quiet. Us. <laughs> uh, I told you to, uh, to not come, didn't I? I didn't want to fight you. I didn't. I mean, it must be so hard for her. But there's no other way. Can't you see? It's already too late. I have no other choice. Oh, she transforming. Oh my god, this music. But to kill you. My mission as the Harbinger is to hear humanity's prayers and to protect the world. Oh, here we go. There's no other option. I won't let you stop me. If you refuse to understand, then I will have to wake you up to the truth. Oh, shit. Okay, she ain't messing around. Ah, okay, so she's weak to that. I really want to do- I don't want to do this, Arya! Parents' wishes... Their sacrifice... I can't let it all be for nothing! Ooh, already Arya, broken. Oh shit, get away, Stop get away. Fighting. Oh, God. Ooh, you don't have much of a window there, do you? You really don't have much of a window. This music is incredible, though. Shit. Double break! Oh my gosh, yes. Pile in, everyone. Pile in. Oh, fuck. I'm definitely getting hit. How did I not get hit by that? I did it. This is what I must do. Oh, shit. This me Honestly, this game's soundtrack has been insanely good. Uh, are you being damaged by your own attack? That's weird. This is really, really sad, though. Okay, I see how to dodge that one. Right, that's fine. Just keep drinking that juice. Ow! Right, let's go over to... Let's go over to Avenger. So yeah, we really should be cycling through so many more of our skills. Seems weak to most of the things I'm using on her, actually. Okay, there we go. Oh shit, as soon as I do my AoE attack, she moves. Break. Okay, nearly halfway. Is she gonna do something crazy at half health? I'm worried. I'm very worried. I am the harbinger. There is no other way. Oh man. How good is this music? Oh shit. Just about. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Okay, so that's nifty. That sucks you in. That's really annoying. Shoot her. Shoot her. Shoot her. Right, 
Right. Think. Just to be on the extra safe side, we'll equip our food. Oh yeah. Okay. 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 Shit. Oh, she's getting really, really pissy now. Food time. There we go. So close. Oh, that was some good damage. Ooh. Oh, run away. Ooh, just avoided that. Oh no. Oh no. I must destroy this one. That is my struggle. Come on. Just lay into it. I can't lose. I Ouch. Ouch. Oh my god, that hurt so much. Oh man, I thought I'd avoided that as well. Jeez, this is insane. Back to let's try Pilgrim. Oh, Pilgrim's good as well. Oh, we've nearly got her. Oh shit! 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 I nearly died. I'm stunned. I'm stunned. No, she's nearly dead. Please, please, please. Oh my god! And she's done. Holy crap! I nearly messed it up right at the end. Oh, come on, Ari, get up. I can't be beaten here. Please stop. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I won't lose this battle. I'll fight to the death if that's what it takes. I won't be defeated. Oh, there's not a second phase, is there? Is that the light from the monolight? What's happening? The monolight is out of control. Must protect them. Ooh. Aria. I am not Aria. I am the Harbinger. My purpose is to protect Lost Gaia. I will fight for that as long as I'm alive. Oh, we're strong enough. Oh, no. Mage, don't. She's no longer the Arya you knew. No, she is. Somewhere deep inside. She will kill you. Nah, no, we ain't giving up. Don't touch me. Oh, damn. We are absolutely getting twatted. It's no use. You're going to die. Oh, no. It can't end here. Don't bother. Oh! Your consciousness is fading. You don't have the strength to get back up again. What? Is this how it ends? I bloody hope not, because the, the bill from Cress is going to be astronomical. Nah, that can't- that can't be. Yeah, that was a pretty hectic boss fight, though. Ooh. It's Arya, by the way. It's my name, you guys have those, right? Oh man, we're having flashbacks. 
Good old sepia tone. Cannot sacrifice the lives of so many. You're right, we can't be certain it's all true. It's not like me to give up, is it? Ari is the only original human left from Earth. She must be lonely. I can't even imagine. You're wrong. She's got us. She's given up on everything. And all she really wants is to destroy the world. You're wrong! Arya is your enemy. No, she's not. I mean, she is. No, she's not. She's my friend. In that case... Then start thinking. What is it really... What is it... What it really is you want to do? I have to save her. Power of friendship. What? That is beautiful. But what? Okay. Save Arya. That is gorgeous. We're on one big sandbar. My stamina isn't even going down. Let's just keep running. Oh. Uh, are you here to save Arya? I'm here to try. Gosh, you're adorable. Yes. Oh, you really are stubborn, aren't you? Even now. Think about it, though. Can you really save her? Well, I don't know, but I'm gonna try. Do you understand the weight she's carrying on her shoulders? I, I again, I can't even possibly begin to fathom. Well... Of course not. You need to know more about her past. Or well, teach us! Let's keep going. Keep going. What a honestly, what a beautiful area. Arya, you see? Well, she's been fighting from the start, right on the front line of humanity. And now for a speech from the head of the project. I'm Arya Lebenthal, your project leader. The world is facing the greatest turmoil in history, and we scientists are rising to the unprecedented challenge. This is war, a life or death war for humanity. Whether we survive to continue our history or not depends on this project. But I believe, I believe that we will complete this challenging investigation. I believe that there is value in continuing the human race. But above all, I believe in our team. I'm still young. I may not have the same knowledge or experience as all of you. But my determination does not waver. That is what it means to be a scientist. To pursue knowledge and keep fighting for, the, for a better future. Very good speech, Arya. Very good speech. Uh, 
How many memories are we going to see? I have to do this. If I look dispirited, then everyone else will want to give up too. So, I'm the one person who must never give up. Isn't that right, Arya? Damn, so the amount of pressure she must have felt. Arya was humanity's hope. She may have even been uh, that way since birth. You saw how her era ended, didn't you? I just want to give her a hug. Ari Lebenthal was a beacon of light, an idol that humankind clung to in the face of extinction. Ari shed blood, sweat, and tears to live up to their expectations, making her name as a great scholar at a very young age. Ari has tried her best to be tough and to stop making excuses for her weakness. Now you want to deny her that way of life? Uh, when you put it like that, it's not like that. You're not good at knowing when to give up. <laughs> Go on ahead if you think you can convince Arya out of her plans. But your words won't get through to her. We'll see about that. Even if you should finally give up when you realize that. Even you should, sorry. Hmm. Oh. Oh my god, wait a sec. Is she hanging in the middle of those? What is this? Oh, yeah. She is strung up. What on earth? That's quite a visual, isn't it? Oh my god. Arya is still in silent. Arya! She has closed her heart. No! No one's words will get through to her now. No! But. You have a feeling. That you're holding... On to Arya's words. Uh, take Arya's words to her. Wait. Like, it. Wait, in my inventory? I'm definitely not. Uh, does it mean like a diary or something? That's just a lot of plant skills and just mining knowledge and I didn't even give in this Connolly doll. Uh, Bondstone. Ah, we do have her diary. It's got to be that then, hasn't it? It's got to be that. Do it, Will it let me give it to her? Ah, okay, right, it just brings you here anyway. Right, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ari's diary, there we go. You hold up Ari's diary. That's... my diary. Oh, so you had it. Yeah, I don't know when we picked that up. <laughs> Can't remember. This diary is the memory of my battle. The memory of how I wished to save everyone. And how all of their hopes rested on me. That's why I have to take responsibility for the end of this planet. I rid myself of my weakness and indecision. This is too much for you to take on by yourself. But I'm not like you. I mean, true. 
I'm your enemy, can't you see? No, you're not. And please don't give me that playing the bigger person act. This is my duty, there's no other way around it. It's not your duty. But I have to. If I don't, it will all go to waste. I have no other choice left. I mean, to be fair, I do feel like maybe we're being a little bit selfish here. <sighs> I'm not the Ari you knew anymore. She is dead. I'm the world's enemy. Even so, I can't just abandon you. We live together. We're almost family. You're still Arya. Oh, I can't abandon you. I'm worried that these choices I'm making are actually going to, like, change the ending, because I know there are multiple endings to this. I apologize in advance if I get the bad one. <laughs> You'd still say that even now? You truly are strange. Tell me your true feelings. Me? Mage, don't... I don't want to start doubting because of such trivial things. I won't make progress that way. I can't be so weak. So I'm... It's okay to be weak. What do you really want, Arya? Tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Sorry, that was <laughs> a terrible moment. Mage. I... The truth is, I didn't want any of this. No, I can't imagine you would. Everyone from Earth, and all of you on Regaia. You're both important to me. So please. Mage. Help me. I'll... I will. I uh, don't worry. I don't know how I'm gonna help you, but I'm gonna help you. Help her down. Let's cut those chains. Cut the ties that bind. That really was a very striking image, wasn't it? I mean, we literally struck the chains, but you know what I mean. Arya! She's back. I believed in you all along. Thank you, mage. I mean, this is all good, but I, I still... We've still got a problem, right? Thank you, everyone. I'm sorry for all the trouble I caused you. Now you're too meek. I can't keep up. Yeah, Arya, that look doesn't suit you. <laughs> we like the girl confident Arya. Yeah, just maybe not confident enough to, like, destroy the planet. No, we're back to normal. You didn't cause us any trouble, it goes both ways. I mean, this was quite a lot of trouble, actually, Cena, but, uh... Whatever. <laughs> I expect nothing, nothing less from Bracca. Thank you all. What's a guy's gonna think of all this? Stop the proto descent. Understood. Oh, he's going to abide our wishes as well. Okay. Deactivating proto seas light descent sequence. We're back to square one now. Yeah. So what? What are we going to do? There's no way around it. As planned, Ari's authority is now considered transferred to me. Why me? What are you talking about? The situation will wait for no one. Hereafter, the survival of the human race will be decided by the notion of the survival of the fittest. Oh my god, so because I beat her, it's now my responsibility? I mean, in a way, that does relieve Arya, I suppose. Oh man. So I am gonna have to make the choice, aren't I? The strong survive and the weak die out. It's the principle of natural selection that is repeated in all living beings. I wasn't trying to gain authority. 
but you have already inferred in humanity's future. You are too <laughs> in too deep and trying to keep. Uh, yet you do not want to take responsibility for that. Do you intend to leave the decision to someone else? Well, uh, you have proven your authority by being the only one capable of persuading Arya, the only Kane. That's not true, Geist. Mage, take no notice of him. That is easy for you to say. You vanished from the Collective and deser deserted our ambition. Regardless, we will get a decision from Mage whether he likes it or not. Come this way. I took the liberty of locking the door behind you. There is no going back. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Um. Oh, chapter 8 complete. Bloody hell. Well, I really don't know what I'm going to choose. Save your current progress. Yeah, I think I probably should. Um, again, I've got previous save files I can go back to, if I so wish. But um, I think I'm just going to take whatever ending I get, chaps. Um, again, apologies if it's one that maybe you guys didn't really want. But uh, I don't know yet. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Uh, okay, I saved over that one. Save that one. File, file number nine. Ooh, what's gonna happen? Proceed to the room where Guy still waits. Oh shit. Oh, hang on. Uh Oh no, it won't let me go home. Okay, I was I was thinking maybe I'd have a chance to like go back and do things, but uh doesn't look like it. Mage, first of all, thank you for your efforts. We couldn't have gotten Arya back without you. It would have been a nice, uh, had that been the grand finale, but I suppose real life is not that straightforward. Whatever happens, I intend to support you in your decision. Oh, boy. Because I know how painfully well... I know painfully well how hard it is to answer a question that has no right answers. There really isn't, is there? There really isn't. Mate, you look distressed. Yeah, I wonder why. Please don't push yourself too hard. Bracca, I need some comfort, buddy. This is the conclusion of all of our actions until now. Do whatever you want. If anyone has a problem with your decision, I'll suck it to him. Oh, thanks, man. That was actually strangely reassuring. What do you think you'll do, Mage? Uh... I can't figure out what the right thing to do would be. I just can't imagine sacrificing so many lives in order to survive. I know, right? Panthus. Mage, it is as I said before. Resist what is correct. Make the decision for yourself. That is the only way to make a breakthrough in this situation. Oh, boy. Geist was a bit too forceful, but I understand what he was saying. You can't deny that the world relies upon survival of the fittest. It happens every day on Rigaya. Even in such a seemingly peaceful world, there are always uh, some getting sifted out. But we come to terms with it because it's the law of nature. It's not something that we're supposed to enforce for ourselves. Very true. Again, can I just say, it's crazy that this this farming simulator game has such heavy topics. So this is what it's come to. Mage, the world's fate is in your hands. I won't blame you whichever decision you make. You're only trying to do the right thing and take responsibility after all. Oh, guys, I don't know what I'm going to do. Mage, I'm sorry it had to come to this. I mean, no, it's no use apologising. All I can do now is leave it up to you. Not many people get to represent humanity, you know. You go in there with, with pride. Pride and extreme anxiety. Oh boy. Chapter 9, What Falls from the Heavens. Do you see it? You humans seem to find this globe beautiful. To us it is just another astronomical body, nothing more than an ark for humanity to live on. Now then, it is time for you to make the decision. Which species of humans should live within heaven's shell and advance their kind into the future? I will remind you that there are two options. Is there no like hidden third option where everyone's happy? Oh, did you have to show me all the all the humans 
All the canes. Did he have to do that? First option is the canes. They are a lost race who's, who rose and fell alongside the planet Earth during the common era. Since the Regaia program was their creation, you Ables are their children in a sense. Your other option is the Ables. That is your kind. They are a race that evolved from Regaia and are almost biologically identical to the Canes. You must already know enough about them. Yep, kind of. I will make it clear one last time. You can only choose one. Ah, oh, but I want both. Should the Canes survive or the Ables? Make your choice on this console. Very fancy looking console, I might add. Make your choice. Oh my god. What are you doing? Stop wasting time and decide. But I don't know what to do. A heaven's shell. Who to extinguish to the future of the human race? Please make your selection, mage. Oh my god. This would be the perfect cliffhanger to end the episode on, wouldn't it? But I really don't know how much left of the game there is, so... Um... I mean... I, f I feel... My instinct is... Save the Ables. Just because I've met more of them. You know what I mean? I don't know any of the Canes. I know Arya does, but... Would she forgive me? I really don't know, but I think I'm gonna go with the Ables, chaps. That That is what my gut's telling me. Um, I don't know if, which is the right option, you know what I mean? I really don't know which is the right option. But it, even if this gives me the bad ending, chaps, this is just what I'm going to pick. If I ever replay the game, I mean, I could also just reload and cho choose the other option, but um, I truly think I'm just going to stick with my guns. We're going to choose this. We're going to choose the Ables. We're doing it. We're doing it. You chose the Regaians. This decision means that Lost Gaians will be wiped out. Do you agree to wipe out the people of Lost Gaia? This is incredible. What a choice. Yes. Oh man, we've just killed so many people. At least they're all sleeping though and they won't feel anything. Whereas if we doomed the, the Ables, surely it would be more suffering. I don't know, I'm trying to justify it, but it's really... It's bloody impossible, isn't it? I'd love to know what you what you all chose in the comments, though. Uh, now executing protocol Harv Harvestella. Oh my god, it's the name of the game. Oh my, is that really what, what the name of the game was all about? Are you serious? That's... Whew. Wow. All Kane life on Lost Guy will be eradicated. Well, bloody hell. Oh my god! I got credits! Is that it? No, there's gotta be, there's gotta be, there's gotta be something after this. Like I said, I'm pretty sure there's an epilogue. Oh my god. Um... I wasn't expecting to see the credits so bloody soon. Did I choose the, did I choose the wrong option? I mean, again, I, I could reload and see the other, the other option. We might do that, actually, come to think of it. Because it's not like I'd have to replay a whole bunch of the game, is it? But um, I'm curious to see what happens after the credits. So, yeah. Um, I, it feels too early to say thanks for watching the game and all that. I don't think we're quite done yet. But, um... What, what a phenomenal game this has been, and I'm, again, just so sorry it took me so long to beat it. If you've watched all of these videos throughout the past year or so, I can't thank you enough. Uh, it's truly been one of the biggest surprises, I think, ever. I did not expect to love this as much as I did. It uh, definitely is a bit of a jack-of-all-trades, master of none. None of the systems are too deep, but the way that they complement each other, I think, just makes the whole package something really bloody special. You know, uh, the story way deeper than I thought it was going to be. Way more invested in the side quests. And the music is, is incredible. 
Um, you know, there could have been more depth to the farming and the combat, but honestly, it's very serviceable and very fun still. So, yeah, we're just gonna listen to this phenomenal music as we set out the credits here, and I, I assume there will be more after this. But, um, yeah, what a, what a game this has been. I'm really, I did not expect the credits to be so soon. We're definitely not done, though. We're definitely not done. Yeah. But yeah, please do let me know what choice you made. At least your first choice. I'm sure many of you have played this a few times already. Or have done what I might do and reload and try the other option just to see. But, um... Yeah, I don't know if I picked the right option. I think I picked the selfish option. Option. Maybe that was wrong. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, I'll join you guys uh, at the end of these credits. Okay. God, that music is just so hauntingly beautiful. Are we... Are we gonna get... Come on, that can't just be the ending. Like, there's gonna be... Here we go. Periodic report 97231. Final instance of Kane life extinguished. Regaia project complete. Commencing plan de gamma? Seths must optimize database for samples of Kane history. Right, did I make the right choice? And the spiral continues to turn, all the while wearing out its shine. Though they held that glimmer for quite some time. Was this truly the only possible solution? I don't know! Don't say that, game! Well, mage. Ah oh, no! It was the bad ending! Even tells you that. Double helix. Well, shit. Okay, I guess we're gonna see the bad end. Oh! That's just it. <laughs> that's just it! That was the bad ending. Wow! So saving the Ables is the bad ending? Or maybe I did something else that made it the bad ending? I don't know. Let's load. Let's load and try the other option then, shall we? Because boy oh boy did that... <laughs> is that not satisfying at all? Let's load and try again.